Welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's me, RP, and thank you so much for joining me, and thank you for letting me steal some of your time. Got a patch. Taxi Life has a patch, and I just found out today, uh, Wednesday, March 27th, 2024, at 1.16 p.m. The Discord gave me a little ping, and I got a patch note. Clicked on the link, and here's the patch notes, and I want to share them with you guys. And I'm so happy that they have uh, put out this patch because you guys have been supporting my playthrough on Taxi Life Simulator. You guys know how much I uh, enjoy the game, and I, I drive with the G920. And uh, you guys have been wondering, why, am, why is my wheel working? Yours isn't working. And uh, I've tried to help as much as I can, but I did tell you in the comments that they were working on it. And here we go. Let's, let's see what this is all about. Hello drivers, this week's patch focuses on enhancing your driving experience with important wheel support adjustments, critical bug fixes, and improvements that the players have been letting us know about. Awesome. All right, patch notes. Here we go. Wheel support improvements. If you are using the G29 and the G920, which is what I use, they are implementing fixes for both of those wheels ensuring a more responsive and immersive driving experience. Force feedback on flat roads. Adjustments have been made to the force feedback on flat roads, enhancing the player's control over the vehicle while using a steering wheel. We've also got some more bug fixing. We've got a little more AI improvements here, so they're still tweaking the AI. The fixes have been applied to both the cars and the pedestrians. Language stuttering fix. This has to do with Japanese, Korean, and traditional Chinese languages. Uh, there is a traffic law adherence. The frequency of AI drivers ignoring red lights has been reduced, promoting a safer and more law-abiding city environment. That's awesome, man. That'll be great. So, like, as we roll up to those lights, it should start to look a little more normal. I have not tested the patch yet. Uh, I, as soon as I get done, uh, you know, bringing this news to you guys, I'm hopping right in my cab. I'm definitely going for a ride. I want to see how these patches are working. And if you guys get the patch and you patch up, Please let me know in the comments if any of these fixes have helped you in your wheel struggles. I really need to know, and it would really, really uh, uh, make my day if you guys could do that for me and just say, yeah, RP, the patch worked. Awesome. Uh, I, I really would appreciate that. And don't forget to hit that like button as well. Let YouTube know I'm around. I'm, I'm trying real hard to give the sim community some good videos. You know, I'm a, I, love, I love playing sim games, and I love the sim community. So, some more fixes here. Floating AI vehicles. Now, if you guys have been uh, watching any of my videos, we have seen the floating uh, vehicles, the magic highway in the sky. Uh, that's the occurrence of floating AI vehicles has been reduced, but not eliminated. All right, so they've just reduced that. Management issues, they've fixed the issue uh, when the player was unable to change employees starting hour without switching districts during shift assignment. So they've uh, addressed that, and there's some uh, minor fixes to the menu navigation. So basically, let's see, do we have anything else here? I don't think we do. Uh, just basically, as, al as always, we want to thank the community for, uh, you know, providing invaluable feedback. So, and that's important. This is from Mike, uh, SimTrack Community Manager. Uh, so that is awesome, man. So they do listen, guys, and because uh, this is a great game. I love this game. It's a great driving game, and I really want to see it succeed. So kudos to the developers for getting out uh, Patch 2. And again, guys, if this helps you out, please let me know in the comments. I'm anxiously awaiting to find out if this helps you because I don't have the problem. So I won't know unless you tell me. So be cool, man. Tell me, all right? Thanks. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Ta-ta and bye-bye.